who is Mohsen al Malk. Nawab Mohsen al Malk was born on 9 December 1837 in the town of Etowah, a part of United Provinces. He was the son of Syed Mir Zaman Ali. He got his early education in and around Etowah. He was given the education of Persian and Arabic. He participated in Aligarh and he was also included in those people who were founder of All India Muslim League. In 1867, he topped in the provincial civil service examination. He was elected for deputy collector in UP. He proceeded to Hyderabad into the service of the Nizam in 1874. Due to his 20 years service he got titles of Munir Nawaz Jang and Nawab Mohsen al Dawla by the Nizam of Hyderabad. Mohsen al Malk met Sir Syed Ahmed Khan when he was posted as Tarsalda in Etowah. He became a strong supporter of Sir Syed Ahmed Khan's vision and the Aligarh movement. In 1864 he became member of the Scientific Society. In order to support Sir Syed Vision and Aligarh movement he started writing articles in Tazibal Aklag. His collection of published articles in Tazibal Aklag was Takalidi Amal, Kitabul Mahabat o Shork Makati, and Ayat o Bayant. On formation of the Committee of the Supporter of the Advancement, Nawab Mohsen al Malk became companion and started collecting donation for the newly formed committee. He got retirement in 1893 from the state of Hyderabad and served in Aligarh for propagating the massage of the Aligarh movement. In 1894, the ninth session of Muslim Educational Conference was held at Aligarh, and he proposed a resolution for the support of Nadwat al Ulama, which was newly formed in Lucknow. On the death of Sir Syed, in 1899 he was appointed as the secretary of the Muslim Educational Conference. After Syed Mahmud, Nawab Mohsen al Malk became the secretary of the College Trust. In his days, the college was passing through the most critical period of administrative instability. Mohsen al Malk was a highly capable man. He, like Sir Syed, worked day and night to put the college on stable footing. He was able to collect the amount of 6 lakh rupees to fulfill the condition imposed by the government. He tried his best to restore the image of the college which had been badly tarnished during Syed Mahmud's time as the secretary. Mohsen al Malk also endeavoured sincerely for the promotion of Urdu literature. During his time the student were divided into two groups. Nawab Mohsen al Malk, with his wisdom and administrative qualities, successfully handled the situation and amicably settled the issue between the two groups. Nawab Mohsen al Malk became secretary of All India Muslim League in 1906. He and his brother Vika al Malk were asked to draft the constitution for the Muslim League. Mohsen al Malk rose his pen in Defence Urdu in collaboration with Urdu Defence Association during Hindi Urdu, which was a rose in United Provinces. He died in Simla on 16 October 1907. For more informative videos, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, World History Official 1.